Hey guys! So today I am going to tone down my hair, but there's nothing really to tone. I'm just gonna basically redo the ombre thing again. I have this Garnier Nutrice in what is it? Extra Light Ash Blonde 111. So, yes, very excited about that. I read reviews on that. I was torn between the Revlon collecting because it was only $2 and I was like, $2, you know? But this was like $5 maybe? I don't know. I'll put the price down here if I can find the receipt so you guys can see that. And yeah, so I'm just gonna try and go for this color that is offering me. I don't know. Focus. So yeah, so I have already sectioned my hair off beautifully into two layers. One, two, three. Um, I don't know, maybe you guys can see the color now. So this is the before. Yeah. So I'm just going to basically I scavenged through the trash and found my little buddy and I'm just gonna see if I can do that. So here we go. Okay, so it is all labeled everything A, B, and C, which is very nice. And I like in the instructions that they have pictures instead of just words. I'm like a picture person. So anyways, so I don't have a trash bag today. I have an old t-shirt from high school that I will never use again because why would I use it? I'm not going back to high school. And so it's a polo and also I hate polos. So I just cut a little bit off scandalous and I button it up so that way I'm protected. But that way when I'm ready to take this off, I can just unbutton it and then there's a big enough hole. I might just cut it down all the way. Who knows? We'll see. First, I am going to take number eight, and I'm going to open it away from me into the trash down here. So just take that off. It's a little hard. Oh, oh I got it. It popped out. Good thing it was away. And so also the thing that it says on this box is that it's supposed to smell a lot better than normal ones. So I'll tell you what I think of that. So I'm going to open that. This is literally the hardest bottle to open. And I'm just going to put this right on this little paper I have. And then it says to take this. Twist it off away from you. Pierce it with this top thing away from you also. I'm just gonna do that down here. Okay. And then it says to just put those on here. That smells actually really nice. So let's see if I can do this better. I'm just gonna do it down here instead of holding it up to you guys. I think you get the point. Just squeeze that little bottle in. And just in case you guys haven't seen my first video, go watch that and see what a fail that is. <laughs> um, but if you don't watch it, it's okay. We have this video to hope and see what happens. Then we're gonna take this oil deliciousness and snap it off and apply. Oh my gosh, this is really hard. And then I'm just gonna, ooh, this smells delicious. It's fruit oil concentrate. Okay, and I'm just gonna do that down here. It smells so good, guys. Compared to like your normal or the ombre one that I had. I'm just gonna pull it in. And I like managed to stick it in there so that way. No residue. I want all that deliciousness in there. Oh my gosh, it smells really good. I can breathe like compared to the last one, the ombre. Breathing that in, I probably shouldn't breathe it that much, but oh, it smells so nice. Also, I'm gonna get my little tool thing and just, we'll see what happens, you guys. So I'm just gonna feel like throwback or flashback Friday, because today is Friday. Oh God, it smells still, oh, just kidding. It still smells, but like the oil smells delicious. When I did this, I had a lot of product left over and that was really sad. So I'm just gonna do this, look at that. Just, woo, all that yumminess on it. Saturate it real good. It's gonna work this time, guys. 
So I'm just going to start from the bottom and then go to the top. So I want it more blonde or light at the bottom, you know. And then just go whatever with this. Oh, it's getting stuck. Yeah, I really hate this thing still. So guys, no. Just gonna put some of that on the gloves. And then just... I think this time around I'm just gonna go kind of for like the ombre effect because I already have the highlights in there. And I'm just gonna rub that sucker in. Down here especially. Then I'm just gonna go all around. I'm gonna let this, because it says on the instructions for if you're dyeing your whole hair, it says to let it sit for 10 minutes. And then the rest of the 30 minutes, um, 20 minutes, the rest of the 20 minutes that you have left with the hair dye to like go and put your roots. So I'm gonna do the opposite. I'm gonna let this sit, the highlights for 20 minutes, and then I'm just gonna do all around ombre for 10 minutes so that way this has longer to sit and then that way the whole hair at the bottom has more time, if that makes sense. Well, we'll see. So guys, the camera cut out, and I don't know how much you guys got to see, but yes, I applied to specific strands of hair. I don't know if you can tell, because it looks like they all just got, ended up being attacked by it. So I made sure that I really, really saturated this stuff, so that way it could, you know, it lighten up compared to last time, and I just really like, I at the end, I just like grabbed the bottle and I just squirted it like right here in this section of my hair just to like really lighten it so that way like it has like a, it's kind of like the roots of the ombre. I don't know. Being creative here. Let's see if it works. Um, I did like a strand that went all the way up here. It didn't really saturate that much. Way when it's in like 20 more minutes when it's time to like apply all of it. It'll be good. So now it has been 20 minutes, um, and I'm just gonna get the bottle and just go in all over. Oh. And just really work that in. Not really creating a perfect line coming through it. Who knows if this is supposed to be right. We're just doing what feels right, guys. It's, ombre is not perfect, so, you know, do what you want. And I'm just going to apply some up here, too. And I think I'm just going to apply the whole bottle into my hair. Is that healthy? I don't know. Who knows? We'll see. We'll do a hair mask if it totally kills my hair. Okay guys, so I have finished everything. Um, as you can see, it kind of looks lighter, so fingers crossed that this work, I, this works, this works, so I'm just gonna go wash this out, and I'll check back with you guys later. Hey guys, so I have finished. I washed out all the product. It is the day afterwards because the sun went down and bad sunlight, and I wanted all natural light, so you guys can see exactly how this turned out, and I am really happy what happened like I feel like this is more of like a DIY ombre so I think that's what I'm going to title it
So you guys know, um, I probably would suggest this over the ombre touch definitely because look at what I got and then also I don't have as much brassiness as I would if I would have if it would have the bleach would have like done its job. So yeah and definitely suggest an ash color so that way it's not as brassy for you guys who don't like it. I think this is definitely what I wanted to achieve. And I'm really happy with the result. The result. I am probably maybe going to lighten it up a little bit in a month or so or whatever. And I'll keep you guys posted what I do. But yeah, I like how it's very natural and just it's not very like bam you colored your hair. But yeah, I wanted to like let people like. Ooh, like settle into the hair as I like get lighter maybe probably the tips more than anything but yeah I'm really happy with the results I definitely suggest that color that I use I mean you can use any one as long as it's ash blonde and if you want to make it ombre then I definitely suggest the extra lightest ombre um, the extra lightest ash blonde that there is that they offer so I hope you guys liked this video, if you liked it give it a thumbs up, comment down below what you think of my hair, if you hate it, okay great, um, if you liked it then yeah share it, I don't know, maybe subscribe if you want, if you think that this is way too complicated then sure just go ahead and spend the extra amount for the L'Oreal ombre, I mean it works but then you have to go ahead and toning if it doesn't brassy yeah so i hope you guys liked it 